Oh shit. So I, I don't actually know. <laughs> um, I forgot to look up the guide. We're gonna we're gonna do uh we're just gonna I was gonna try and go for the the childhood friend, but for the life of me I don't remember what he does. We're just gonna try some stuff we haven't tried before. Oh, we did library stuff before, but we didn't chase down everything to do with the library, right? Pretty sure. I mean, I don't remember, so it makes it a bit like... A bit more like, uh... We'll see what ending we get if we just fail to romance any of the birds. Boring as usual, da, 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 da. not enough books. So at least the view is nice. Nobody here. Ghost, um, we're in the same outside of the the library. It just, yeah. Oh. Can you talk to Mageki here? Can't. Let's talk to Ryo to just hedge our bets. We'll get one or the other, I think. Sure. Huh? That's your lunch. Haha! <laughs> yep, it's a calorie. Boop. Calorie Mate is an official product that is available in Japan. Pretty sad thing to bring on the pigment. <laughs> Such a Metal Gear Solid reference. Jeez, if you eat like that, you'll be dead on the roadside by the time we head back. Yeah, I'll share mine. Wow, thanks for giving me food. I got to eat half of Ryota's lunch. His cooking is so good. He can save the calorie. <laughs> In case of a survival situation. Just like in Metal Gear Solid 3. Uh, let's just do maths again. I, I don't know what I'm going for here. And just We'll see what I can do. As long as we don't get the math teacher on uh, response again. Oh no, go away, not now. Oh. Buy the more iCloud, thank you. What should I do? Go to the library. If it went out of the yeah. If no one asked. Do you know this? Cool. Okay, Sam. Oh, racist. There doesn't seem to be very many, like, people at the school. You only run into about ten people. <coughs> yeah, let's go to the library, because fuck sports. Uh, I think I'll rest in the library. Much better. Less that the AC is on, but do we really need it? Nobody's in here today. It's not on. Huh? You. It's just a ghostly chill. He's so a ghost. 
Whoa, he actually is polite and remembers people's names, unlike apparently the rest of this school. You don't turn it on, it just feels cold compared to outside. Oh, is that it? Will it be used in June? Anyway, aren't you going to participate in the festival in Nageki? Aren't you? Eep! I don't like outside. So I stay in here. I see. Ellipses. Why are you sitting next to me? Do you mind? Not really. Uh, our class president got duped into being a cheerleader and... Ellipses. Sorry. No. Keep going. Okay. <laughs> and so I spent the day telling him about the festival and whatnot while he read. I don't know how much he was listening to me, but he didn't seem to mind, I think. Who are you talking to, though? Who are you talking to? Tasaka. You'll be fine. Good. He's happy, yay. Just don't date me like last time. Sir. Mmm, today is a good day. Let's go to the library. Oh. Let's go talk to you, you and fuck the whole run up. tree make a wish any birdie I know where's Nageki what should I wish for become a famous artist we're ignoring mad love of a fallen angel that's a weird side thing. Uh, if I go, if I talk to you though, then I might end up getting getting to the the wrong. Sorry, you might get the wrong idea. We attend maths. We attend gym for some change. Attend gym. Saka, sir. Great success. Do, do. It's been a semester. Seemed long. Oh, yeah. 
Ah, I'm trying to remember what bits are bits so. Oh, okay, so I don't remember this. Am I the only one? Oh, that's a job easier. I'm probably not alone. The Geki. Are you here? Please be quiet and lonely. <laughs> oh, hello. You're rather noisy today. Did you want something? I'm just wondering if you were alive. Of course, I'm always here. Volunteered, you must like books. I was wondering what to read. Nuts. What about? this before. Uh, that's the problem with these things, you run through them too many times and it's a bit like same, 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 that's why I've been leaving more gaps in between and like giving myself more break time from it because it's like otherwise you end up going playing through the same scenarios, not even sure if you're gonna get the right ending and then you end up like having to do shit multiple times because it's like you know some of the guides aren't correct as well they're like do this and do this and do this and you will get this ending and it's actually like you know there's some other things you need to do oh man so yeah, like we've read all this before, so I'm just going to talk over it. Uh, yeah, I started watching Dragon Ball recently, and boy, is that not a kid-friendly? I thought, oh yeah, Dragon Ball, original Dragon Ball, must be PG, right? But there's a lot of streaking, a lot of, a lot of kids just naked and panty shots and gunfire, straight up people pulling out guns. Like, Goku gets shot multiple times. I never realized this. I never realized what Dragon Ball was, but there's an entire episode which is predominated by Master Roshi going into a lingerie store to buy some lingerie for Launch. He's just ignoring him because Launch is that, that chick that when she sneezes, her split personality changes. And, um,. She changes into like a gun wielding blonde psychopath for a short period of time until she sneezes again. And uh, she's like, oh, tee hee hee. I don't know what anyone means. And then she sneezes, and then she's like, I know what you all mean, and you're disgusting. And then she starts trying to shoot everybody. Um, anyway, the whole thing. One of the episodes is him telling Krillin to go get an ice cream while he goes and pervs at a lingerie store. And he's like, hoo, 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 hoo. and he goes up to the lady and is like, in his brain, he's like, it's like a Homer moment of like, behave yourself, Master Roshi. And he then goes up to the clerk at the lingerie store who's like, can I help you, sir? And he, his response is like, oh, can you just put these on for me and show me? And he's like, got these red, on, like red lingerie. Um, you know, if I like what I see, even might be in a tip for you, huh? And he gets the shit kicked out of him by this lady who reasonably is like, "What the fuck, no?" And he's like, <laughs> "I could beat an up there woman for being a fucking creep who should be on a list." And you're just like. Yes, not PG. <laughs> not PG. Let's not apply for the. Oh no, we have to get the job and then give it straight away. 
to VOT. Buta, Rota, I don't know. A lot of these names, I've never heard them anywhere. Oh my. Pardon me, miss. Back a new. Parakeet. You can't date this guy though, apparently. Vitality girl. He doesn't get a human form. Yeah, so we've seen this before as well, so I'll kind of talk over it again until Ryota comes in. Uh... Oh, he's here already. I should give the job to him. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, I will always be here. Invite. You can invite Nageki. That is his name, right? Oh. Yeah, I want to see. I want to know if he's a ghost. <laughs> so if you choose him, you just go, oh, well, never mind, fuck it. What is it? Yeah, you are right. It doesn't have to be very long. I'll write one later, leave the paper there. Thank you. This is how we find out. I think that's everything for the September issue. We. Why does she do this? I've never met anyone whose response to anything without it being like a stupid ironic joke or like an in-joke or something in immature to say. Whose response to thing is, what? It's like, what the f that's something that you do as a joke, right? You know I should have gone up when I first woke up. No, never do that. You overslept. Overslept? Oh yeah, this. I think we have to go to the library again. I'm just assuming, because he never leaves the library, so... Wah! Wah! <laughs> Too bad. Waluigi time. I want to library. Fuck you, Nanaki. I'm sorry, I know life's been very hard for you and I didn't mean to say that. 
Looks like mostly food, yes. Uh, okay. Wing. He's here. Look at he. Did you need something? Why are you here? I don't mind standing. They'll just ignore me anyway. Are you being bullied? Dwing. He falls silent. If there's something wrong, I'd like to help. Maybe that was the wrong answer. Good morning, everyone. I hope you did it. Uh, yep, yep. So yeah, we, we've done all this before. Time keeps slipping into the future. Is it focus? So, I feel like that was quite a Nageki heavy episode. I should like... Oh, is that... Oh yeah, the student ID. We'll never unlock this mystery because I'm too fucking stupid. So, oh. What is it? take care of it. We never worked out what the thing with shoe was, did we? One day we will. What should we attend? I don't want to fuck everything up now, but Jim! You got a lot of whiz. Cool. Oh. I don't want to hang out with Okusan. Bore me, Okusan. Uh, I guess I'll go look around. He's in the library. Yeah, well, we don't even have a choice. Let's just go hang out with Nageki. Close it. I knew he'd be here. The door, close it. Oh. Staying in here even today, it's almost like this is where you live. <laughs> is there something wrong with that? Of course not. You're kind of like a friendly ghost or something. It's reassuring to know you're here. I brought you something. Your plan to stay here all day, right? What are cookies? Bird watching club was selling bird shaped cookies. Is bird watching just kind of like stalking in a world with sentient birds? Like, you know. Or is it the equivalent of people watching, where you're just kind of sat on a bench and you're watching people go about their lives and you're like, Hahaha, I'm aware of the simulation. Hmm, I can't eat because I'm a ghost. Hearing him thank me makes you very happy, even if it was a whisper, because I'm overbearing, apparently. He even looks a little happier than usual. Third years of doing a play, a long class put together a god tier. <laughs> Haunted house. I was thinking of looking around a little more. Nageki want to come? No, I can't leave the place I was murdered. He looks... He looks angry. I... No, thank you. Go ahead if you want. Well, alright. Sorry, I didn't mean to try and drag you out of here because apparently you are tethered to your murder. Sorry. This is just my theory. I have no idea. I think you might actually live in here. Now I think about it, I've never seen him anywhere else. Maybe he comes straight here as soon as he gets to school. I've never seen him outside of school. Ah, I got too excited for the festival and didn't study anything. Where's my history book? I was reading it in the library. So maybe it's still there. Ah, now you're a ghost. Welcome back. Where are you going? Do you have the door still open? Somebody bought the key to the staff room a few minutes ago, so I think it's locked now. Oh, I'll get there first. Thank you, sir. Is he the murder victim? But we get the ID card and we don't know whose name it is. If it was Nageki, we... Here it is. Yay! Oh. Somebody's written on the left. 
page I left over. The Congress dances but does not progress. Well, that's funny. Don't write on people's book. That is in no way something that we should be concerned about. Sounds like something a fucking killer or ghost or like some creepy pasta shit would be like. Don't leave books lying around with the pages to the four winds. I'm always here. Why are you so surprised? I hadn't thought you'd still be here, as it was it was locked. They locked you in? That would be terrible. It was? What an introvert. <laughs> Sorry we locked you in. You locked me in? <laughs> <laughs> you're supposed to make sure that no, there's nobody left inside when you lock the thing. Anyway, I need to lock the thing again. I should... Go home with Nageki. Hey Nageki, let's go home together. No. Impulse finger battles be rude. Where do you live? I'll walk you. No. <laughs> you always get mad when I suggest you go outside. Blang. Don't jump to if I could I'd What? Oh my god, he in I'll lock the door, so just leave the key there. He's already reading again. I think I'm annoying him. Ghost. He even, one of the first things he says to you is like, oh yeah, you know, you could just jump out that window or something. Was that him? <laughs> like, you would. If you, you know, if you like it, the view. Ah, ah. My grades aren't looking very good. I need to work harder to recover. Go one by one, the student's gonna... I look up, I'm alone or not? Ghost. How unusual. I think this is the first time you sat down next to me, Nageki. I want to talk to you. You're nothing but surprises. I'll leave you alone if you're busy. No. I was shocked when you first came and talked to me, Mr. Saka. You're the only one who didn't ignore me. No one but you has ever talked to me. That's why this is the only place for me. That's terrible. El Terrible. Nageki, that's awful. Which class are you in? So to our teacher. I'm not done talking yet. Shut up, bitch. Sorry. <laughs> you think I'm being bullied, right? I thought that too. You're not? I don't think so. Being bullied might be better than this. Better than this? And what is he? Dead? <laughs> I'm not sure yet, though. When you talk to me, I remember things. <laughs> Sometimes, but it's still not enough. Is there a jump scare in this? I don't understand. What do you mean? I think I'm... Tasaka, you're here late. Sir! School's starting to close. Go home, you nerd. It's good to study, but working too hard on your own will make you a nerd. Backfire on you and everyone will be like, look at this Dweebenheimer. Look at the door and get home, you Fucking nerd. <laughs> On my own. I was right. So, what are you talking about? I'm not Al. I'm not Al. Huh? I guess he's gone. Or dead. He was here just a moment ago. Maybe because he's a ghost. Did he leap out the window and go home? Ninja style! <laughs> Teenage mutant ninja Nageki. <laughs> We've got our finals back today. Between midterms and practice exams, whole semester been nothing but tests. To soccer! Sir! So, good job I spent all that time in my library. What? Proof that volleyball helps. She beat you by two volleyball points, Shiragani. Oh well, <laughs> I think I made that joke before. Rrr. This is Masats. Nostalgic. My hard work paid off, yippee. Kaye, mother truckers. Closing time already, I don't really have any reason to be here again until the semester starts up. Oh no, it's snowing! Oh, it is in winter. I was like, what, in June? It's clear when I left. 
crossing the wilderness to get to my house in a blizzard, my cave in the blizzard. I'd be risking my life. Still here. Alone with me. <laughs> Nageki. Book under his arm the same as always. Do wonder about last time, but if he wants to talk, then he'll talk to moi. For now, I won't bring it up. I was about to go home, but snow. I guess I have to wait until it stops. He makes a noise of agreement and sits down next to me and says, one of us. He's been a little bit <laughs> distant lately, but maybe he's warming up to me in his own way because now you're part of the library too. What are you reading? Dickens? He licks chickens. <laughs> Christmas Carol. Sorry. Someone I knew at secondary school, every time someone mentioned Charles Dickens, he'd go, Charles Dickens licks chickens. And for the life of me, I never got that out of my head, and I can never take Dickens seriously ever again. Thanks. <laughs> like, every time I'm trying to, it floats through my head. Well, I'll read some Charles Dickens. They're free on the Gutenberg project, at least, or the Kindle store, I'm sure. No, I can't so give up. It's Christmas Eve. Shut up, ho. You're ruining the book. Oh. So meme, excuse me. I completely forgot. I guess this makes it white Christmas. That, that's a terrible joke. Looks like a white out Christmas. And everyone's just there. Looks like you're almost finished. Yep, I just got to the part where Tiny Tim dies and Scrooge sees his own grave. That sounds fucking horrific. I prefer the Muppets version. You haven't read it? No, I watched the Muppets movie like any sane human being did. <laughs> Even though you work here. I'm Buddhist, so get the fuck off with this Christian shit. Burn the churches? <laughs> it creeps into another LP. Tim is a boy born weak who dies young. The protagonist, Scrooge, sees what will happen and tries to prevent it. Time traveler. I thought it was a classic, but it sounds kind of science fiction-y. It's not the focus of the book, though. I like to see the future. It would be nice to be able to avoid getting into trouble and see the horrific timeline that we're on right now. Uh, see if we can reset the world with Made in Heaven. I wouldn't like it. Moi, the future is what it is. It is what it is. That's all there is to it, unless you have a time that fucks. A stand that fucks with time. Or a time that fucks with stands. Enjoy the present point in time. Nice way to spend Christmas. Alone in a library in a closed school with a fucking ghost. The sun. Okay, Christmas. 1st of January. Sun. Wish it were like that. Looks like I'm still alive to enjoy it. It's cold. But it's clam. And the sun is wham. I think I'll go visit the Shrin. <clears throat> All the boids. All the boids. All the nice boids down at the Shrin. I think I'll go buy an am amulet. Amulet. I was trying to deliberately butcher that. Joko. Dwang. Happy New Year. I don't care. Oh, wait. This may be Buddhist. I don't know if I care. What are you doing? Looks good on you. You came here to buy an amulet, right? Which would you like? I like the one that detects ghosts. Art. Art. There we go. <laughs> I ain't afraid of no goats. First day is always busy. Get busy. Oh god. <laughs> Lunch. No, you you still ignored me too much and we're never gonna have lunch. Fuck off. 
Okay. Peace out, my life, bish. Huh. He gets the Duck of Doom. Oh, the Chicken of Ill Omen. Duck of Doom, whatever. Uh, where should I take this one? Duck of Doom is a munchkin card. If you get the Duck of Doom on your head, it just fucks your fucking <laughs> stats up. Bork's Blessing. We got that last time. Thank you, sir. They walk among us, the, the talking pigeon people. Wait, is this... Is this whole game just made by David Icke? The pigeons, they walk among us. They pretend they're one of us. They're not. <laughs> Jesus. Plastic lizard people. Zuckerberg alien. Oh, jeez. I accidentally watched a few conspiracy assholes really late at night, and it started to make my skin crawl, because I was like, Oh, what if they're right? He does look like an alien. Oh. Junior year will be over. Please don't let Zuckerberg take all of our data and our souls. Please don't allow that to happen. You're our only hope. He's not a real person. He's not a real person. He's not a real person. <laughs> Illuminati. Wee! <laughs> Tomorrow's Legumtons. Disgraceful. The Pigeon Reich will live for a thousand years. Uh, beans. Just feels like the pigeons kind of came in, you know? took over and it's a bit authoritarian from what I've been seeing. Get yeah, some calm corn. I think I need it. <laughs> After dealing with conspiracy videos. Oh boy. Almost empty. The heating doesn't work. So the winter we were in here when it was snowing. The few students here are huddled around the heater, so Nogeki should be in the rafters. There you are, sitting in a frigid corner from the meager effects of the heater. Because he's a ghost. Please be quiet in the library. How romantic. Oh, can you somehow forgive my dreadful sin? Brr. It's cold here. Are you okay, Buster Wolf? I'm fine. Don't mind me. If you're cold, because you still have the flesh of the living. No, I'm fine. My house is a cave. Because we were driven out by the Pigeon Reich. Uh, I've just got all these wild theories <laughs> about this world. Um... We finish them all and it will reset the simulation and then the alternate universe where, like, the protagonist is in a wheelchair will start and it will be very, like, what the fuck, <laughs> like, you know? You're supposed to give beans to the important bird in your life today, because, yeah, the patriarchy. Do you want them? <laughs> yeah. Gimme. Don't know what to do with food. Because I'm a ghost. Did I lose? I feel like... Oh, there we go. Requested books are going to come in today. I have to work through lunch. Sorting through these takes forever. I think I just have the encyclopedias to do before I'm done. There's a note on the desk help counter. Their desk help counter. Be here after all the other students have left. I don't want a samurai jewel. How fitting. No, it sounds like the fucking The Ring or something. <laughs> like, it sounds like, be alone. Come here alone. Only you can see me. Japanese horror. Is it going to start, like, vomiting hair on me or something? What it's all about. Vomiting hair? 
climbing out of a well and crab walking. The Geki. No! <laughs> I don't like it! Geki. Please stop being creepy. You startled me. How long has this been a horror game? <laughs> From the very beginning? <laughs> oh god. What did you need? I want to talk with you. No, don't talk to me. Continue our conversation. We we're talking about bullying. The strange Swedish thing called bullying. I'm all ears, except I'm a pigeon, or a rock dove, or a morning pigeon, or a morning dove. I can't remember. So you don't really have, like, uh, ear lobes in this. Oh, so who cares. <laughs> I'm not sure where to start. I've noticed a lot since we last spoke together. Ellipses. Mr. Saka. Huh? Let's go outside. Nani? But you're already dead. Oh, it fits so well, fits the North Star, yeah. But he hates going outside. <laughs> come on. Come on. Hey, come on. Uh, walks over to the door, I follow agitated. You first. And then he pushes me through a portal to the Hell Demon realm. Okay. Why does he want to go out? I should be happy, but ha! Huh? He's. Oh no, he said, I don't like this. Go back to the library. He said he wanted to come out here. He stands in the doorway, pushing against open air. What are you doing, mime? Watch. He's back a little ways into the library and then runs forward, crashing into the air. Oh fucking hell, I don't like this. No, don't go black. No! <laughs> Stop! He bounces off the invisible wall, falls back into the library. That's too good to be a mime act. I can't leave. You didn't try before, though, so how... Are you just a melodramatic introvert? <laughs> or are you a ghost? I can't leave this room. I wake up in this library after a while, I lose consciousness, and wake up here again. And so it repeats. Oh... I said I'd come to understand the truth by talking to you, Mr. Saka. You probably noticed too why no one else talks to me. It's because you're a ghost! They can't see you. You just ruin it. Is it because you're quiet? Maybe you should speak up and play the Vivi Zayla. Uh, I'm the only one who can see you. Perhaps. <laughs> I forget why I was here. How, can I, how I came to be stuck in this place. I've been alone for years with no one to talk to for years. How do you know if you can't remember? My sense of time. The world, oh. I cannot re feel or remember the passages. Five school festivals go by. I can't remember past that. But then you came. You walked right in and sat right down. You talked to me. I had had no partner. Although the simulation's breaking. But myself for so long, and suddenly you wouldn't leave me alone because you're a fucking weirdo, you stalk ghosts. As I talked to you, I finally remembered why I can't leave. Blang, you were murdered. Oh fucking hell, it's even darker. You killed yourself in this room. So here I stay. My clock broke here, its hands turning meanestly. You should say the same as the last. Alone for- Oh god! <laughs> Why is this game? No one here is bullying me or ignoring me. I'm not here to begin with. I have no regrets. It was my choice to end my life here after all. And he's going transparent. But I think I will miss you, Tasaka. And none of the teachers ever went, you're sitting in this room where a known suicide happened and talking to somebody like, oh, Nageki's here, and you mean the suicide that happened in 05. <laughs> no one sits there and goes, um, <laughs> you know, asks any further questions. If I wasn't like this, I would 
totally tap that ass. Nageki, I wrap my arms around him, but he's a ghost, so they fall through. I can feel him softly, but he's cold. Oh, he's a corpse, that's even fucking worse. First sitting here alone was painful, but I grew numb over Tim. Seems to feel pain, that feeling that I thought I had lost Kim Mick because of you. I'll talk to you enough to make up for everybody else, Nageki. Maybe one day you'll be able to leave. No, I'm fucking dead. Let me die. <laughs> As I told you, I changed. I didn't know until just recently. When you told me about this school, he's flickering. I don't like it. I was probably trying to take back the time I was never able to spend here. I never asked you to, but relentlessly told me everything that was going on here. I already felt like I spent a full year at the school. And now it's over. Why did you kill yourself? They're going to stop soon. The wheel of fate is turning. Ah, oh, his voice sounds muffled and distant. I, I busted a ghost. Does this happen to cute girls at high school? Is that why they're all a bit weird? They find ghosts who are like, Finally! A girl noticed me. Now I can get past my suicide. Bye. <laughs> like, you know, guy from like 1970 is like, Girls don't notice me. I'm gonna fucking kill myself. And then, like, he's just bothering girls in the late aughts, going, Hey, can you see me? Girl. <laughs> like, you know. Oh, if I had to do all that every day, fucking ghost simping on me, I'd be pissed off too. Um, look down, his feet are gone, but, you know, we never talked about feet. We've never talked like this before. I don't want this to be the last time. Don't cry, Mr. Saka. I'm already dead. Don't cry for me. <laughs> Don't cry for me, I'm already dead. There's no one here to mourn. But, just one thing I need to tell you before you go. The thing that I noticed secret that stopped me clock. Don't say it, Gaggy, this is weirdly emotional. So I felt like I grew closer to disappearing. You're the one who made me disappear. I can't stop it now! Still have so many things to tell you. You gave me calm corn, that was enough. I'm satisfied. <laughs> the secret. Thank you. I love you. That was more emotional than some Netflix seasons I've watched. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> it's a ghost, the whole... And I was sitting here taking the piss, and they legit did, they, what? I'm mad. I'm mad. No jump scares, but, like, that's good. Dreams end. That's two devastating endings, one after the other. Two emotionally disturbing. What is wrong with this school? Got like a maths teacher who lo lost the love of his life. Pid like budgy sparrow breakups, and now ghost dove. Oh my god! I don't like dating Sims anymore. Okay, so which one have we not read? Oh no, I've seen that one. Oh. But they don't explain why he killed himself. I don't explain, like, they said it's suicide, so it's not the shoe thing, unless she was, like, harassing him. And it was a while ago. I, uh, like, I want to know the dark secrets. I've been feeling better since that nosy girl showed up. I do not think I'll find any answers like this, so perhaps it is time to close the curtains. I am fulfilled just as I was back then. Back then? Back when? In the year XXX. XX. Well, that's a great place. It's like midnight here. <laughs> like, great. Now I'm going to be dreaming of fucking ghost pigeons. Oh, jeez. I don't feel good about that. Oh, no, we did archive. I meant gallery. Let's just quickly spy the gallery. 
Yeah, it's just dreams end, right? So we got ending, ending falls down here. What's this one? Oh, this is uh, Sakuya's. So I'm assuming his not full ending is two. One is Ryota. This is Nageki. Huh. I, I, so many more endings here. Look. God, like let's look at the depressing ending. So we had. Snobby guy doesn't want to be aristocrat. Actually just wants to be a musician. Seems like fairly okay. Ghost. The Pudding Odyssey was pretty good. The fact it's called 2011 A Pudding Odyssey as well is pretty good. The depressing Nanaki ending. And the true Java Sparrow, where we basically double downed on ruining a relationship that was pretty much already ruined, and they always do kind of say, "Don't go back to your ex." So I stand by helping Azami that way, but I want to see the other ending where they drive off into the sunset on their weird scooter that obeys the traffic laws. Oh man, do we get another screen? We only got Pudding Odyssey screen, we haven't ever got anything else here, so...